Learning to code is a slow process, but quitting won't speed it up. Some people might be able to learn how to code in just a few weeks. Others might take years to fully understand the magic of code. A while back, I made a decision. I decided I wanted to start creating videos teaching people how to code. I wanted to share code snippets on my website so that others could learn. I wanted to share my experience. I made that decision because there are things I wish I knew when I first started coding from the perspective of an individual. So here we are. Learning to code is one of the most difficult things you will attempt in life. There is no easy path. There is no shortcut to mastering the art of coding. Wake up early, stay up late, make time to code, study for three hours each day, take no days off. Ask yourself a question. Is what you're doing right now getting you closer to where you want to be? Life is full of distractions. Five minutes here, five minutes there, and your whole day passes you by, and you're no closer to where you want to be. Either you run your day, or your day runs you. I know, we all want to feel comfortable, but your pursuit of comfort might be what's holding you back. Your brain tries to steer you towards your comfort zone, but realize, nothing grows there. When you're comfortable, you might tell yourself, I'll do it later or I'll do it tomorrow. Often later becomes never. Tomorrow isn't promised. Do it now. Maybe you're a thinker. I'm a thinker. I like to think about things. I tend to take deep dives into my thinking process. The problem is, if you spend too much time thinking, you might not get things done. So maybe now's the time for you to stop thinking about learning to code and just start learning to code. Knowledge is not power. Knowledge is just half of power. Success requires action. But remember, there are no shortcuts. Learn the fundamentals first. Take it step by step. Learn the syntax of the coding language you want to learn, and then learn how to think like a programmer. First solve the problem, then write the code. In life, there will be people around you who may not understand what you're trying to accomplish. They might even try to talk you out of it. But remember this, your dream is your dream, not theirs. One problem that we all have, that we all face, is that we have too many options, too many decisions to make. This often stops us in our tracks. So what's the solution? Eliminate your options, take away your safety net, burn your bridges so you can't go back. Fear can often drag us back into our comfort zone. Make a decision and run with it. Don't second guess yourself and don't give yourself a way out. There's a reason why Bill Gates takes part in Think Weeks. His cabin is a sanctuary, free from distractions. He spends his time reading, learning, growing. So turn off the TV, put your phone on Do Not Disturb, stop checking your email every five minutes. Don't regret how you spend your time. Speaking of regret, we all dwell in the past. I wish I would have started learning to code sooner. Today, I'm a full stack developer. I wish I would have done this. I wish I would have done that. You fill in the blank. We can't turn back the hands of time, but we can control what we do right now with our time. Don't let yesterday take up too much of today. That being said, 10 years from now, you will look back at the you of today. What will you think about yourself? Don't be afraid of failure. You learn more from failure than you do from success. Making mistakes is part of the process. This is something I like to tell myself. Failure will never overtake me if my determination to succeed is strong enough. Life will knock you down. It's up to you if you get back up. Life will put obstacles in your way. It's up to you if you let it stop you from achieving your dreams. Life will challenge you. It's those challenges that make life so exciting. We live in the greatest moment in time. You have all the knowledge in the world right at your fingertips. All you have to do is Google it. Your potential is only limited by your mindset. We all need to be a little bit more disciplined. Discipline is doing what needs to be done even if you don't want to do it. 
Did you know there are 2,270,592,000 seconds in the average lifetime? Question, how do you spend each moment? My advice to you, don't just work hard, work smart. Don't just work smart, work hard. Success is only your responsibility. Get code done.